hello, hello. How is everyone doing? I hope you are doing rather well, having a good day, wherever you may be. We are back in Stoneblock. We are continuing where pretty much where we left off. So one thing I need to do, the next thing, how is everyone doing by the way? Hope you're all doing well and having a grand old day. We need to make ourselves an unfired crucible from porcelain clay and I should have done that like that. There we go. We only need seven. There we go. Uh, and I got some bone meal. You can get bone meal by sieving dust in a flint mesh. So take one of these out. That's a string mesh. You want flint. Uh, or, if you go to the mining dimension, there are mobs, there are mobs in, was that a thing? I feel like something happened then. Um, there are mobs in the mining dimension, so that's what I ended up, I killed a few skeletons, just came upon them. Uh, so we need to do that, get the unfire crucible. And now, to, to heat this, we've got crucible heat sources here, which is rather excellent. Um, and it looks like, you know, the same type of things. The fire, it looks like one of the best early game thing so obviously we need some netherrack and i don't know we're getting we're getting an exception here for i don't know either that or that i don't know why um lava three times and then the best by far is awakened draconium um this superheating element from mechanism 60 times and that is just you need a bit of steel uh osmium uh redstone and copper that is pretty good like that's that's really good. So that's always an option. Uh, I am just making, as you can see, some seared brick. So you need to put this in here to begin with. To begin with, you need to burn this basically or smelt it, whatever <laughs> you want. There you go. And we get now a crucible. There we go. And we've now got that two two things done. Where's the rest of this? There we go. And now where shall i for now where shall i put this let's just let's just shove you here so torch there that there and then you basically you shove stuff in until it's full and it will make some lava for us which is rather excellent let's see what we get crucible random reward uh, oh we've got a just a gargantuan drum okay well, lovely stuff. Right then, now I've got some of this seared brick. We, of course, need to start making, like, parts of the smeltery. So I believe I need... Uh, oh, hang on. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> I need to do it with this, not the... There we go. So I need two of those. I think I need one of these, maybe? Yes. Uh, I need, I think, the controller. Yes. And what else do we need? What else do we need? Wrong button. Uh, oh. Drain tank. And that is it. Okay, so the drain and tank. I am getting, there we go, look at that. Lovely stuff, like I know what I'm doing. Who knew? Who knew? So I think that is the drain. And then... Is the control... Uh, no, the tank? Is it something? No, that's that. Tank. Boom! Completed! Who knew? There we go, that's that stuff done. Ooh, inventory. Eat to upgrade your inventory. Oh, that's from Cyclic. Uh, ooh, ooh, that was all exciting. And uh, that just means, I don't know what that means. Oh, it means we have like a proper, a proper crafting table. Um, but it's only accessible there. That's a little bit annoying. I wish that was just immediately there. Um, shortcuts, auto refill, middle click. More options. Even, yeah, let's turn that sound off. Sort of pick up chest. Ah, I'll, I'll look at that later. So I need to make a little smell to it. So I've, I've made like little areas. I made like the worst, the worst stone hammer. Uh, it takes like, <laughs> I use it like three times and it dies. But uh, it was just enough to just quickly do that. So I'm going to make a smeltery now. How is the lava coming? Um, still quite slow. Let's maybe put some, can we put some more cobble in? Not really, not much. So I'm going to use the first bit of lava to um, to do that basically so that we can, uh, we can make that a little bit faster. And then when we get some netherrack later on, I will do that. So I'm going to make a smeltery now, but I'll do that off camera. Right, there you go. To begin with, just three at the bottom, then all these along there. Uh, I tend to put the drain on a side like this so that basically we can use the two the two faucets like that and like that. 
Uh, smeltery controller I always put in the middle and then a tank there and then that is basically it, isn't it? Yes, look at that. We've got that. How's this going on? <sighs> Still going oh slow slowly. What is the next thing that we need to actually do? Ah, a cobblestone generator, which technically I suppose uh, Boom done lovely look at that. That was nice. That was very very nice. Uh, what have we got? Mechanical crafter two of them that's quite exciting that's that's not bad that's okay um so obviously i'm waiting for lava this is what we're doing right now we're sort of waiting for lava to happen and then uh fluid crafting so that's the next thing so stone barrel and then yeah make some netherrack so one of the first things i want to do is i want to smelt some um whoo, let's put that there i i would like to smelt some iron so that i could get a um a better pickaxe head uh if i put iron on that basically uh i can i can do that what i'll need to do is get some more clay because i'll need to make a clay cast first so what you end up doing and i'll just show you just in case people don't know i'm guessing a lot of people do but just in case and you put that there you put some clay in here like that oh that can't be smelted so i'm guessing we need to uh, we need to hammer it down. There we go. Like, oh, no? Not, oh, not enough heat. Okay, so we could have put it in there. Okay, yes. Obviously not enough heat. Uh, and we then make a clay cast, which is only usable for one time only. Normally, you'd make that out of gold, basically. It makes a cast, then you put iron in here. Uh, dump the iron in, you can see it now, and you can obviously, you can expand this uh, by building these higher. And here's a tip for you, rather than making more uh, seared bricks, what you should do is just dump a load of cobblestone in, and it will ma make seared cobblestone, and you can make it quite quite high and tall like that then. So that's just a little tip. Have we got this yet? We are oh so very close to getting some lava, so let's get the lava first. Let's do that. Oh, I say, I say let's, but we're still like a little bit off. Look, when that, when the liquid lava, when it gets to a thousand, that is a full bucket's worth of lava. So what else do we need to do uh, right now? I would like, I am thinking about going to the end. So to reach the end, mine to the top of the mining dimension, the end, like other dimensions, are almost completely solid. The end is made of end stone and end ores. Would be nice to be able to get a... um. Uh, an ender pearl just so hey have we got we should have yes yes we do um mainly so that we can get an open blocks elevator which would just mean that we that is now going yeah look at that that's a lot faster that's happening a lot faster um so that we can get an elevator which means that we could travel right to the top a lot quicker that would be nice so i'm gonna get more lava now dump it in here and start to make a better pickaxe right then i've got a clay cast right there and that only took two bits of clay because look i've got some more in i've just got some uh, iron so let's smelt that out and now you'll see that this cast will die there you go it will die its death but now what we can do is upgrade um upgrade this there you go uh, and you can see, so I've got four modifiers, and I think if we take that out, what happens is... Oh, we still have four modifiers. That's rather excellent. Um, I've just been sieving some dust in an iron mesh... Uh, an iron mesh... Iron stiffened mesh. Not iron mesh and stiff. That would just, that's just all, all sorts of wrong. Um, so... I'm going to go mining now, try to get some more redstone, which shouldn't be too bad. And I want to get some blaze, basically, because I hear the plan. Uh, I don't know what accent that was, but I do have a plan. So I found a mine, like, well, not a mine, a cave, I should say, in uh, in this mining dimension. And look what I finally found. Uh, what have we got? How many? I think, was that? Oh, is it just two? Are you kidding me? Just two. Oh, four diamonds. Okay, well, that's that's something. Four diamonds, that's not too bad. It's basically all I need to get started with or what I would like. So I'm going to head back. Uh, it's around here somewhere, and I can't remember. I've got to be a bit careful. There's a lot of monsters around here. I seriously need to get some armor now and um, and level up a little bit uh, if, <laughs> if I can figure out where is... Oh, uh, some, some gold... 
There we go. Let's get that. One good thing about this now is I've got magnetic on it because of the iron. Uh, and where is home? Okay, let me just figure out and I will see you back at base. So I am back at base. And the first thing we're going to do is do that. There we go. And get ourselves a bit of netherrack. That should complete a quest, I thought. Oh, we need 16 netherrack. Of course we do. Why, why would we not need uh, a ridiculous amount of netherrack? Fine, I'll, I'll basically keep doing that. But uh, what does that, what that does mean, is if we take that away, there you go. That's another little bit of netherrack, and let's do that. Put you there like so, and then where is, where is some flint? Thank you very much. Boom, I don't know why I got two bits of flint, but there we go. This should now be at five. Yeah, there you go. That is a lot, lot better. So, 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 we can now start to fill this up. Uh, I've also started automating all of this, which is great. Uh, <laughs> that's not what I wanted. There you go. So you can see this is now doing its thing. Uh, two clocks on here so that I can, and both these point into this chest. And that was just to make, oh, there you go. You can see there's actually some seat stone still in there just to make this a little bit larger. Uh, although I am now, of course, running out of fuel. There we go. Uh, I need to put a hopper into that so that that goes in there like that. So that's another little thing that I can be doing. Uh, what I want to do next is get the auto sieve and the auto hammer, I suppose. Uh, so if we look at the sieve, let's have a little look-see. Um, auto sieve is just that. We can do that. We can totally do that. So let's have a gander. Um, do I need a sieve as well? Let's use one of these, because I'm not actually, you know what, I thought I was gonna use these a lot more, uh, and it turns out that I'm totally not. So, have I got any more iron? No, no I do not. Uh, let's get some of that, there we go. Right, so, auto sieve, we need two of those bad boys, no problem. Then we need some of these bad boys, and then we need and that right there, lovely stuff. Gun to DW in a box TM. Okay, well, there you go. We've got that. Got ourselves that. Uh, oh, I keep doing that. What do we get? Another gargantuan drum. Well, that's something, I suppose. That is something. So, uh, I also I also would like uh, an auto hammer thing. So, hammer, which is remarkably similar. So, I need a, a couple of those. And there we go, uh, and then I need one of these, which is why I wanted the diamonds. So auto hammer, bam, and those just go together rather nicely, uh, very nicely indeed. So what I'm now gonna, what I want to get on with is obviously we've got a way to make lava. I want to make this faster and better so that I can power this. And the way I think we. To begin with, what you tend to do on a skyblock, at least what I tend to is, we, we work off lava power, so we have this. So what is this? Uh, that's that. Uh, I need a chest. Can I do a chest? Yes, we can. And I think I might need some lapis. Let's get that, maybe. I don't know. Uh, we need some gold. Definitely need some gold. We got, we got gold and we need some more lava. Have we got some? Yes, let's shove some more cobble in there. So five times faster is a lot faster. So you first. Oh, I don't think we do need lapis. Well, that's okay. Furnace generator first. We need a furnace. There we go. Thank you. Uh, magmatic generator. There we go. And lastly, bam. Thank you very much. So. If we shove lava into here, basically what we'll get, what we will get, there you go, is we will get power. We will get power. So that is basically the plan. I want to make this faster so that we can grab some power. And I think what I would like to do is if you remember, if you remember, uh, if we look at the crucible heat sources, so right click on that, then you get there is we're gonna, I'm gonna try and, why not go for the superheating element? Okay, so we need four copper, so copper, um, well, let's do it this way, I need to go, oh, is it only mechanism, maybe? Oh, maybe we cannot do that, ah, has copper been gated? 
Well, well, well. That might that might have put uh, the kibosh on my plans. Oh no, there's look, there's copper or ah yes, has all copper. Aha, no, it hasn't. Excellent. Right, so what's the highest level? Like sixty-eight or something? Yeah, level sixty-eight-ish. Um, so I'm gonna go hunting for some copper, and then the next thing we need is a blast furnace. Blast furnace. Um. So we need 27 of those bad boys, so we need 9 blaze powder. I've already got one, can get it through sifting, or I'm guessing we can get it through one of these, the burning effigy. So this basically would spawn a blaze, like an actual living blaze that we could then kill, and, you know, hopefully get some blaze powder out of that might be a more fun way of doing it look at this cheeky little setup that i have at the moment two crucibles uh, and then if we come around here uh, you can see i've just got some transfer nodes for liquids pulling out said lava and depositing it into the magmatic generator or this drum i figured we might as well we might as well be using that now on in the quest for steel i've only got six netherrack still uh, for the moment uh, I've been looking around and I discovered something. So where is steel? Where are you? Steel? There's an... Uh, where are you? Why cannot... That is not that. That yeah, Here it is. Here it is. So I was looking at crafting recipes and I came across this. Look at this. Coal, bit of iron and a stone hammer used for crafting only from tiny progressions. Uh, that is that. String, string and hardened stone. Hardened stone is unhardened stone with sand, uh, cobble, and clay. I can I can live with that. That is that is awesome. So, uh, what did I just say? Sand. I've got some clay somewhere. Yeah, let's just use this. Uh, there we go. One, two, three, four. Where's my hammer? Where's my hammer? So that is rather an excellent thing to to have. I think so. Cobble. I don't have. Did I? Yeah, I got some. And, oh, I need some sand. I need some sand. Do we have any gravel? Do we have any any gravel anywhere? No. Oh, this is also doing its thing. Look at that. Look at all of that loveliness. That is rather excellent. We can actually probably turn that off now. I like to turn that off, you know, just in case. I don't really, when I don't really need it, I've got a little bit of that. So I don't need all of this blaze powder. That's the um that's come on. Ah, there we go. We've got some sand. I knew I had some somewhere. So, so 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 let's go through this again. Uh let's actually look at tiny progressions. Tiny progressions is a great little like helper mod. Uh and there's actually a lot of stuff in here now. Wow. There's a lot more than I think last time I played a mod pack with this in. That is rather lovely. Um look at it all. Uh, so I'll have to look at this because usually, um, let's make two of those. Usually it is rather excellent in terms. So this, an iron furnace, it should be a little bit faster than your standard cobble furnace. So I think we just needed two of these and we needed some string. And I think we needed some sticks. Did we have some? Yes, we did. Yes, we did. There we go. Two of that. Let's have a look at this hammer thing. Um, hammer. There it is. Stone hammer. What am I? Oh, another bit of string. That ain't no thing. Little bit of string. There we go. Right. Bam. Okay. So now, what else can we do with this? We can make. We can make cobble from cobble. Huh. Uh, obsidian dust, that's quite good. Chainmail part, okay. But most importantly, we can do that. So we need some coal. Have I got any coal? Have I saved any coal or have I been using it all? <laughs> We've been using it all. Yeah, I've got, I've got some, I've got some, I've got some. Right. Um, uses that. Uh, and I can't even remember why I needed this now. Oh, I know why. I know why. So we needed the mechanism, the superheater thing. Super... Um, heating element. Aha! So, steel casing. So, I need four. Four bits of that. Okay. Well, we can do that. We can do that. Bam, bam, bam. Excellent stuff. Uh, super heating element. Uh, osmium and glass. Glass I have somewhere. There we go. And 
And we also need some cop. <laughs> oh no, something's something's mixed in there. Uh, that was not supposed to happen. How's this? Yeah, this is empty. Right. There we go. We can do that rather quickly. Right. Let's get this back. That doesn't even take any um any durability, which is rather good. And oh, osmium, osmium. Boom. There we go. Uh, you. You steel casing, oh very lovely, and oh I need this to be on again now. Do your thing. There we go, and we just need. Are we getting? Yes, there we are. We're just getting some copper, so that's all we need. Uh, and if we look at the uses for that, sixty, sixty. So this is an upgrade from five, five times, as you can see there. Uh, to 60, uh, which is rather excellent. There we go. Superheating element. Boom. Bam. Yes, please. Thank you very much. Let's have a look if we now uh, get you. Thank you. Let's, can I, can I, oh, I can't actually get under here. I want, I just wanted that little bit of uh, netherrack there. Just because that's uh, nice for us, you know, to have the netherrack. And let's put that there now. 60. Look at that. 60. 60. How? Right. How quick is this going now? So the point you can see. So each each full number. So six. That's six buckets basically. So we can we're getting a lot more, like a lot more lava, which is rather excellent. So that's going to help us hugely with power. So I need. I need. I think 12 bits of netherrack to progress this little section. Uh, ooh, hey, hop. So one more. Bam. 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 And that should do a thing. Should it not? Oh, no, 16. Oh, of course it is. Of course it is. Ah, oh, we're okay. Let's just quickly do this. We might as well. We're so, we're so close. So that is going to help our our power like we can make a few of those quite easily they're not hard to make um what am i doing what am i doing <laughs> i'm getting all confused there we go 16 that should do it and that, has it done has it done a thing has it done a thing yes yes and we get a biome marker which is interesting so this is the hell biome and it said if you look in this little section here says uh, make some netherite rewards this reward is repeatable in case you lose it, as it is the only way to get the hell biome. Which is interesting. That is interesting. So I don't know if we need to make hell, basically, in order to, I don't know, get stuff or do things. I do not know. It doesn't really doesn't really give us any more information. But uh, that is rather nice. So obviously we can make better cobblestone. Endstone, going to the end is like the only other thing that might be applicable for us today but i think uh we're probably gonna have to end it there because i think uh our time has run out for today so that is basically we sort of we, we kind of sorted out our power situation right there just getting that super heating element which is rather lovely so thank you so much for watching hope you hopefully you're still enjoying uh stone block 2 i very much am very much excited for the rest of the series as well. And uh, pretty soon I'm going to start going to start actually making this a little bit nicer. Now we have the ability to get a bit more power. Uh, I've got an idea. So thank you so much for watching. I've been Hector. This has been Stonebook 2. Uh, if you did like it, do the things in the comments and subscribing and whatnot if you fancy. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.